Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that, Father, sometimes the youngest not receiving that love can be the problem. I must be really dreaming. On any given Sunday, they give me Willie Beeman. When I battle him, I make him feel whack. I want easy in Detroit. Ain't nobody getting killed, smack. Cause it's a difference between metaphors and real rap land slide. Easy to block captain, go find that man and do not come back until you find that man, B. Yeah, you you the one. You 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 the one. The block cap finally made it, nigga. Cut the talk. Let's get straight to them. You, yeah, you you on fire right now. You on uh the the, the one show that 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 you got going on top ten or ten ten or whatever. And then you got Bel Air. And then you got all the URL battles. And your your profile is building. And you've been cooking niggas. You ten and zero on the app. Ten and zero. You know niggas might try to sprinkle. You know he didn't win this. He didn't win that. Nigga ten and zero on the app. That's probably the fastest start ever. Calico called you out, B. He wants you for summer madness. And you got to go find that man, because after that chess battle, yeah, you got to clean that up. You the hitter now. You, you, you done earned them shoes. You earned them dancing shoes. Now you the hitter. So now it's time for you to hit something. You got to, you got to make a play. Because the way that shit went down, I, it was nasty work. I ain't gonna hold you. Even though like some shit might have slipped in and out, clip, clip, clip. But from what I see, from my vantage point, Chess got clipped. Whether it be 2 1 or 3 0, oh, Calico clearly won. First round, Chess was, uh, you know, throwing up and shit. And then, you know, he was choking again another round. And he got the second one off. It was mer he He had some moments. I ain't gonna hold you. He had some moments. You know, I had to go get my own switch. Like, I, I never, I'm from the Bronx. So I never get, I never get over Chess's flow. You know what I'm saying? Um, coming into this battle, I did feel like there was, that Calico has a flow, a stage presence, and a poise to him that could defeat rattle, a lot of battlers at the highest level. And Calico don't lose a lot of battles. He don't get the respect that he deserves. I even tweeted today, Calico's win over chess is not loud enough on my timeline, and I don't like it. And niggas are saying, you know why. I'm like, I don't know why. Like, his, his win should be celebrated. His wins get looked at with glasses. His losses or perceived losses get looked at with a microscope. I don't understand. Like, I don't understand this. Like, what are we, Midwest bias or something? He clear the man clearly won the battle. Like, he said, I must be really dreaming. <laughs> they got me on any given Sunday and I'm battling Willie Beeman after Chess already had thrown up. Then he said that shit about, uh, you throw up in battles, I know you ain't never slid. Like, this nigga was wilding on him, son. I expected Calico to be good, but this was really good. And I know a lot of us, are susceptible and want to see easy versus uh, goods and want to see, you know what I'm saying? We want to see them easy versus Geechee. But somewhere in this year, Calico got to run that. You got to see Calico. You have to. Like, like he Calico doesn't set the matchup up. He's in the middle of smoking your man and then he calls you out. Nah, you got to, you got to answer that call, big baby. Like, I, I, I see it happening. And you on fire right now, too. Like, easy, you hot. You 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 could talk with Calico. You could have that conversation. And I'm not gonna be too crazy about the chess shit. Chess has problems when it comes to acid reflux. Anybody that has acid reflux knows how it goes, know how it deals with your internal system and things like that. So, but for some reason it's like whenever his situations pop up and pop up like when he's about to battle or when he's in the middle of battles like it just comes out of nowhere and then he's finding himself throwing up and shit um but if he gets past that you know he's fitting the wall like he had material that's the worst part about it he had material and his material was a1 but i just cannot get past the stumbles and the chokes like and it was like the throw up, like it just was like he was taking long, almost two, three minute breaks. And I will say this, Cal was at least receptive of the fact that it was happening. He was kind of like trying to calm the crowd down and still letting them get the rap and things like that. While other MCs might have took that as a, as a advantage of that. Like I said, yo, 
like and just started rapping over you while you down there trying to get your shit together. So I will say that. But as far as Calico goes, this is a win for him that he should get the admiration and respect that he deserves because he just showed you. Even he's beat other people too. Now don't get it fucked up. You know he takes a he takes a perceived loss against Surf and everybody wants to bash him. Oh, Cal ain't like that. Cal ain't like that. He just had a battle versus Gucci guy where I felt like he got that. He had the battle versus Verb where I felt like he got that. He had the battle with Chess where I know he got that. Like what are we doing here? You know what I'm saying? Like we gotta start giving the same amount of love that you would give hate if he didn't if he came up on the short end. And I know if Calico would have been would have lost. If Cal would have lost, there would be a different energy in the streets right now. Totally different energy. And it can't happen like that. And I'm from the Bronx. Chess is from the Bronx. And I'm still keeping it a buck in order to be honest. I'm saying what it is. Like, y'all niggas got to, y'all got to call this shit fair across the board. We can't be in a culture or, or, or engaged in something where we're going to celebrate one way when somebody wins and then we're not going to celebrate when somebody else wins. Nah, give Cal that love, man. Like, you got to, you got to, you got to get up off that. You got to show love. You know what I'm saying? Like, especially when a nigga put, they, put that work in, put that pain in, and, and Chess is wilding, and he comes through, Cal has his rounds, and he's bugging on him. Nah, you got to get that up, man. You got to get that up. We're not doing that. No, we're not doing that. I don't want no show. I don't want no no nothing. I would do my own thing on this YouTube. I don't want to be part of the. I don't want to be part of the organization if I got to do it like I don't want it like that. We're not doing that. But easy. What we doing? You wanted the matchups. You wanted the names. You wanted the competition. You have to add Calico to the list of names that you should see this year. I think that. Uh, I think that. When it comes to easy to block captain, he's risen faster than damn near anybody in battle rap. You don't see rises like this to the point where niggas who's in the middle of classics or doing their thing is calling him out. He got called out. So it's like, yo, niggas said, well, I battled him in Detroit. Ain't nobody getting killed smack because it's a difference between metaphor. Oh, no, 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 no. Nah, we not doing Easy got to go have that conversation with him. And I know he will, too. You know what I'm saying? Because that's one thing. He replied to him, too, and said, I don't duck no smoke, summer madness. That's what he said. He said, I'm not ducking no smoke. I like that, though. Don't duck no smoke. Don't duck no wreck. You address that shit head on. And y'all niggas should, y'all should have that fate. Because Calico got by chest too easy. Like, he didn't even take off his warm-up. I'm going to be honest with you. His jacket was zipped up. They had to tell the nigga to zip his fucking jacket down to get the microphone. Zip, he zipped it down a little bit. He didn't even take off his warm-up jacket. Nobody's talking about that. Nobody's talking about that. Oh, okay. 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 So it's just me. Okay. I did 30000 on a recap yesterday where I was just, you know, freestyling this shit. But nobody's talking about that. He did it without even taking his warm-up off. Nigga didn't even break a sweat. Then you break a sweat. Nah, you got to get. You got to have a little bit more combat than that. Cal got to have a little bit more combat than that because uh, I don't like. I, 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 want, I want. I want Cal to get into some wars. I don't want him to have no no free games, no blowouts, like winning by thirty. Nah, man, y'all got to make this nigga work because he's too much of a legend to not work. You know what I'm saying? And um, now, to me, I feel like he already proven his worth and proven what he do. Show niggas time and time again. He's done that a thousand times over. But now he's doing it on that high level where it's like, yo, Geechee's on fire. I'm going to battle Geechee right now. Chess is on fire. I'm battling Chess right now. Uh, Easy's hot. I'm battling Easy. He's battling the hottest niggas at their hottest point. This right here was probably Chess's hottest point. Coming off that Easy battle where it was like the battle of the year. Coming off of a battle like that. Into this, mad niggas thought Chess was gonna win. I ain't gonna hold you because they thinking of the performance that he just had versus Easy the Black Captain. Niggas like, oh, he should. If he does that again, he should fare well. Like fare well, but um, it was like a farewell. It, he just, I, oh, man. it's one of them things where you know the nigga nice, you know he got skills, you know he can hold his own. But he has to get past the reflux shit. I don't know how. I ain't no medical professional but that's the only thing that's gonna hold him back because we saw unfortunately 
we saw a vintage chest, but it wasn't the vintage chest. It was like the vintage, like the, the shit that we wanted him to work past. And I'm sure he's going to be back, but it's just one of them things where you know, like a classic. That was a potential fucking classic. That second round that chest had, that little nigga was wicked. Cal was wicking it on three, so we ain't gonna do that. Cal gotta win clear, and I'm from the Bronx. But it just was like, Chess had some shit in his second. He had some shit in the first two, but he just, he just wasn't clean, you know what I'm saying? If it ain't clean, it ain't mean, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, we're gonna either uh, barbecue or make baked beans. I'm out of here, man. So salute to every single one of y'all. Gang. Easy. Yeah.